Um, Gary Johnson this morning on uh, Morning Joe had a problem identifying Aleppo. And not that that's like, well, that's definitely something that if you're running for president, that's something you should know. So I'm going to play this clip and, um, and then we'll discuss it. Here's Gary Johnson. What would you do if you were elected about Aleppo? About Aleppo. And what is Aleppo? You're kidding. No. Aleppo is in Syria. It's the, uh, it's the epicenter of the refugee crisis. Okay, got it. Got it. Okay. Well, with regard to Syria, um, yeah. I do think that it's a mess. I think that the only way we, we, that we deal with Syria uh, is to join hands uh, with Russia to diplomatically bring that at an end. But when we've aligned ourselves with, when we've supported the opposition. I'm sorry, uh, Governor. I'm sorry, Governor. I have to stop you there. Okay, that's enough. Um, so in fairness to him, uh, to Gary, uh, Gary Johnson, um, once he realized what Aleppo was, <laughs> And that it wasn't Alpo, the dog food. Uh, once he realized what it was, he was like, oh, he actually had something that he could say to it. Um, and truthfully, so let's, let's delineate the differences here, right? Let's talk about this. So I don't expect the average American to know what Aleppo is. I do expect the average American to be able to take a wild guess that it's a city. That's it, right? You don't have to tell me where it is. You don't have to tell me what's happening there. But in, you know, taking the context cues from, um, I forgot the guy's name from Morning Joe, taking those context cues, I expect that you should be able to tell us that Aleppo is a city. So I don't expect a lot from the average American um, only because there's so much happening, so many places around the world that it's really not reasonable to ask the average citizen what's Aleppo or to give your commentary on Aleppo. But if you're running for president, I'm sorry, if you're running for president, you should know not only what Aleppo is, where Aleppo is and the significance of the city. Now, here's the problem. Um. Gary Johnson just, well, actually, it got worse. So let me play a, another clip, and then we'll discuss it. Here's, here's Gary Johnson, part two. People are making a big deal about this Aleppo thing. I'm just curious what your view is from just like, is it a gotcha thing? Should you have known it? In retrospect, do you know it? Well, when, when you recognize what's going on in Syria, when you recognize that, the, that Aleppo is in the kind of the epicenter, be, n Aleppo, um, <laughs> not knowing that there's a city in between the the wow the two forces really wow. at the epicenter of the but not remembering or or identifying that that's aleppo uh guilty <laughs> but, but but in retrospect is it is it a town you it's a name you know a town you know i mean this is good this is well, going to yes, be a, yes, this is no, going to no, be no. a big deal like this is like the first big <laughs> flap of a campaign that's been doing yeah. pretty well right it's going to be it's going to be deal. a big flap i promise you I'm like <laughs> oh, it already no, is no, so I, I, i'm just wondering I, I, sort I of how you no no i i'm i'm yeah. incredibly but how you, frustrated with myself right or right so how do you but how do you feel about it like should it be a big flap like well sure it should um absolutely all right that's um, enough of that i i want to stop because ultimately he says that i just got to get smarter <laughs> and you know, I mean, in all fairness to, um, and actually I'm pulling up his statement, um, the Gary Johnson uh, <laughs> Aleppo, um, he put out a statement. In all fairness to him, the most, um, I think it's important to admit when you've messed up. I think it's human, right? To err is human. To, um, to ask for forgiveness is actually divine, right? Not just forgiveness. But um, Gary, um, uh, Governor Johnson, he put out a statement, um, and I thought the statement was uh, pretty good. So I'm going to read the statement here. Um, this, is, this is his press release after the fact. He said, this morning, I began my day by setting aside any doubt that I'm human. Yes, I understand the dynamics of the Syrian conflict. I talk about them every day, but hit with what about Aleppo? I immediately was thinking about an acronym, not the Syrian conflict. I blanked. It happens. 
and it will happen again during the course of this campaign. Can I name every city in Syria? No. Should I, should I have identified Aleppo? Yes. Do I understand its significance? Yes. As governor, there were many things I didn't know off the top of my head, but I succeeded by surrounding myself with the right people, getting to the bottom of the important issues, and making principled decisions. It worked. That is what a president must do. That would begin, clearly, with daily uh, security briefings that, to me, will be fundamental to the job of being the president. So in terms of, like, how you handle this type of mess, you know, I mean, I still get the feeling that Gary Johnson doesn't really have a lot of uh, intellectual curiosity. That's just the look I see on his face. I'm sorry. I just he doesn't strike me as a person who's um, altogether serious. Um, but I totally respect this response because um, if it had been Donald Trump, Donald Trump would never have admitted that he didn't know it. Right. If it had been Donald Trump, I did an impersonation earlier. I don't think I could do it again. I'm not even going to try. But Donald Trump would have certainly said, um, I've heard a lot of bad things about Aleppo. Um, we have to look into that. We have to, you know, people are saying that there's some serious things going on there and we have to consider what we're going to do. So I'm going to listen to all. That's something Donald Trump would have said, knowing full and damn well, he doesn't even know where Aleppo is. But. Gary Johnson, I think he took the, 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 the highest road someone can take in a situation like this. Um, but so that you do not turn out like Gary Johnson, um, I want to give you four quick facts that you should know, that everyone um, running for president should know about Aleppo. Um, the first thing, uh, yeah, because you never know. There may be an occasion for, uh, for you to run for president. And if you're asked, what about Aleppo? You need to be able to answer some basic questions. So number one, the first thing you should know about Aleppo, it, it is the largest city in Syria. See, nothing hard, nothing difficult, nothing that is groundbreaking. You don't need, uh, you don't even need Wikipedia for this. It's the largest city in Syria. Number two, it is one of human, now you might need Wikipedia for this. It's one of uh, humanity's oldest continuously inhabited cities, um, approximately inhabited since 600 BCE. So it's one of the oldest cities in the world. Pretty basic stuff. Um, in terms of the Syrian conflict, um, you should know the Battle of Aleppo, uh, 2012 to the present. It's an ongoing conflict between the Free Syrian Army and the Islamic Fronts, the People Defense, and I'm reading these people involved, right? Uh, I don't expect you to know everyone who's involved, but you should know that there has been an ongoing battle in Aleppo uh, called the Battle of Aleppo. Just a freebie there. All right, so the people involved in the battles, the Free Syrian Army, uh, Islamic Fronts, the People's Defense Units, uh, and Sunni uh, militants against the Syrian government, Hezbollah, and the Shiite militants, militants. All right. Last but not least, the fourth thing that you should know, the very basic thing that you should know about Syria, uh, about Aleppo, is where it's located. So I actually pulled a graph up, um, a map up, rather, of where, um, of where Aleppo is located. Pull it up on your map now. All right, so right next to Iran, <laughs> southwest of Iran, south of actually, no, this is how little you know about Aleppo because this is actually not real. This is the real graph. <laughs> so Aleppo is in Syria. <laughs> Syria is north of Jordan and, of course, west of Iraq. But if you're going to know anything, just know it's the oldest city, uh, one of the oldest cities that we know of. It's the largest city in Syria. It is the battlefront. It's the battleground of it's the Battle of Aleppo, the ongoing conflict since 2012. And if nothing else, you should know that it is a city in Syria. So just in case you're on Morning Joe and you're running for president and we're still seeing a Syrian civil war, you know, God forbid, in 20 years, um, you'll at least be able to answer that question, unlike Gary Johnson. Sorry, Gary. I'm, I'm sorry that, you know, it was a rough day for him. But still, again, kudos. I'll applaud him again for owning up to it.